You warm enough? Yeah, I'm fine. I think you're right. I think he likes it out here better. What are we going to do when it starts snowing? We need somewhere else. I don't think Ruby would be very happy about that. Yeah, then she should stop pinching his cheek every time she gets near him. Oh, maybe he likes it. He doesn't. Here. <laughs> this is for you. There you go. Thank you. Whatever you're feeding that baby, keep it up. It's beautiful. And you were saying? Didn't expect to see you two here. Hey, Jay, how's it going? All right. How about you? Fine. Jay's? What do you want? But can I, uh, can I say hello to my nephew? No, which you already know. You're here for something. What is it? Jason, you ought to, uh, <clears throat> relax with the paranoia. I'm just here looking for Emily. You know, since we're, uh, since we're being honest, you should know that I've been cleared to visit with Carly tomorrow instead of you. Was Evans going to call me or just let me drive all the way up there and then turn me away? Oh, no. I told him I'd let you know. Now you have, so leave. Gee, you're really taking this well. I was afraid you might object. If you scare Carly or make her lose it, I'll do more than object. Oh, Jason, come on. You know Carly. She's not exactly the model of consistency. You never know what'll set her off. You take the chance of seeing her, AJ. You're responsible for anything that happens. Ooh. Okay, would you like me to check in with you when I get back? So you can lie some more? AJ, you can lie to me all you want, but you lie again to Carly. If you do anything to keep her away from Michael for one... Dada. Extra day. It'll cost you. I may not be able to call a strike anymore, but I can still get to you. Well, it was, uh... It was nice seeing you both. Bye, Michael. Started. What? Carly's using AJ against you. The other day that Carly told the doctor she didn't want to see AJ. I guess she changed her mind. As soon as you walked out of the room. She's trying to get to you, Jason. I know. She wants to be released. And she probably thinks this will pressure me into making that happen. Well, can you talk to her? Tell her that AJ has an agenda? Carly knows not to twist AJ. Besides, she's going to have to play crazy the whole time AJ's there. So... You're not going to do anything. If I warn her about AJ, she'll know she's getting to me. And if I lean on him not to go, he'll tell Carly. That'll scare her. And when she's afraid, she makes mistakes and she can't. If she loses it, she could get locked up permanently. Or if she's more angry than you realize, she could do something drastic to get AJ on her side. Like what? Like tell him that he's Michael's father. Be away from her. Nothing has changed. Carly knows if she told AJ about Michael, AJ would grab Michael in a second. Then if she doesn't trust him, why is she seeing him? I told you, she's bluffing me. Now, she's pretty sure I'm doing everything I can to get her out, but just in case, she's gonna push me. All right, let's go. Hey. Yeah? Do you know how much I love you? Yes. That's how much I hate having our lives depend on someone as unpredictable as Carly. Robin, I can handle Carly. Okay, she always wants something. She pushes too hard, I shut her down, and she quits. It's a pain, but no one will get hurt. We'll be okay. I promise. Yes, we're going right now, okay? Yeah.